Hello everyone, welcome back to Hollow Knight. So, uh, we're back in the world, we're gonna have another journey down into the depths of King's Realm. Last time, uh, we got our first ability, which was, uh, it's, it's the, uh, the Soul Burst. Yeah, Vengeful Spirit. That does blast our soul in a direction as a ranged attack. It uses up a third of our total soul. So, right now there's a lot more to explore, but generally the way that this works is uh, whatever abilities you get lets you uh, unlock another region that uses that ability specifically. So, if you look over here, I definitely can't go to that part on the top because that goes to, I believe, the crystal place. The one below that is the super dark area. I can't go either of those ways. I can't go to that place above me because that's where the spikes are. So I actually might have to go to this place to the left. I can't go to the bottom. There is a place down there that I'm seeing. I might go try that out, see if there's something there. We'll see. Okay. So I'm gonna have to go this way this time. Can't go up top. But it does look a little bit safer. Alrighty, so we can't go down. Oh no, that's below us. Yeah, so we go this way, cross, and up. There might be something there. That was a bit stupid, but it was fun. Alright. So oh, this was the uh the place I had the first uh mini fight room. Yeah. I guess I didn't go up here. Huh. Oh, what a find. It's a hot spring. So the way hot springs work, uh so now it's on my map. If I use up all my salt, for example. The hot spring not only heals me, but it gives me all of my soul. Really handy, so it's always great finding these. Alright, uh, I can't go down there, I know that, because that was the jump I couldn't make. So, that does leave the last place, which is the area on the left. And there's two entrances there. So I'm gonna have to try out both of them. a bit of a annoying jump I have to make. But it looks like there's a platform up here. If I jump to that one I should be able to get up. Okay. Alright, so let's just go a little higher then. I do want to pick up as much geo as I can because I need to start saving up for the lantern. Me to go back down. Oh, that resets all of these guys. That's annoying. Okay, 
Okay, so note to self, don't accidentally fall back down there from clearing enemy. What's here? Ooh. I need to heal up before I accidentally die. The hell? Okay, uh, maybe I can... Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't think I can get up there just yet. I'm gonna give up my search in this direction. And we're gonna head back over to this one. Over here. Ooh. Sign. Pilgrim's Way, travelers of Hollowness descend through verdant wilds and fungal groves to the city, this kingdom's heart. There, all wishes shall be granted, all truths. Oh, yep, this is definitely where I should be. This guy's here. Perfect. Um, something about this water tells me I should not touch it. That's a good call. <laughs> ah, the new region green path has been discovered. With all sorts of new enemies too. I'm gonna have to be careful. Oh, okay. Uh, so you explode. And you also explode after death. I can kill those birds. This one doesn't explode because it doesn't have the weird smoke. Yes, the water kills me. That's an instant kill. So that's good to know. I should start utilizing this ability. Nice. Oh! Fuck! Can kill this thing. That's good to know. I guess I can see where these bush boys are too. Maps updated. I don't have a map for this area. So I guess that just means until I get the map and find the map boy here. I'm not going to be able to actually see any of the updates I've made. Okay, that's fair. I hope the map guy's close then. Hello, who are you? Can't jump up there, so... Okay, so you're fast. Oh. Ooh. Okay, so that smoke does last a while. It's not like just an instant. 
As long as that smoke is there, it will damage. What's over here? Another way? Okay. this boy. Crushed him. Clearly, I was wrong. Come on. Nice. There's my map boy. Oh. Very good, I did that. Ah, here we go. Full circle. It's a shortcut now. Yeah, this place is actually a lot nicer. Crossroads <laughs> seems like a very uh, like a start of a civilization type thing. This is a very green, peaceful. Alright, so this is the map we've got. So clearly, top left looks like where we need to go. You can see where some of the benches are. Oh, crushing them doesn't give me Geo. Yeah, I can see where some of the benches are, so I guess I just... Hmm. I should start going there, but this looks weird. Um, I think this is the monster journal place, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> yep! Hello! Let's put up babies. The hunter. So this is like a almost like a little mini side quest type thing. Hunter's journal. So the whole thing behind this is uh, we can look at the hunter's journal in here, and we get information about all of them as we uh, kill them more and more. So the first time you kill a thing, you get the first in piece of information, and the second part, which is below those creepy eyes that look like his face, those are just like extra tidbits after you kill more of them. So as we can see for this one, we need to kill a lot more of these venge flies to get the uh, rest of the hunter's note. Hmm, it looks like there's more Grus mothers, Which is weird, because it's a boss. Or mini-boss, I guess. What about the false knight? Okay, so this was just a one and done. Killed the balders. But yeah, there's a lot of things. What is this? What's this? I've never seen a shade. But I know what this is. Shade is what happens when you die. You need to kill your shade because that's like your soul. You need to kill it to get it back inside of you. Hello, little grubling. Okay. Let's see. Uh, those look 
like the only way to go for now. Follow the path. Where's that person again? Those who stray from the White King's roads shall face the law of Un. Well, what's Un? What? See, now that I read the lore, I'm finding things that I'm really confused by. And I want to understand now. Understanding is good. enemy. Let's die already, thank you. You know, thinking of a game from a logical perspective is obviously a stupid thing to do because you play games for the fantasy setting that they provide, but whoever thought of the idea of, like, enemies dropping money upon death I, I just want to know what they were thinking at that point. Like, I can understand when you're playing an MMO and all that, you're just gathering materials that are based off of the enemy. But this is just like... They're just randomly... They've got cash on them. Oh, hello. Okay. That was a giant-ass thing. It took one hit, and then it went to a smaller form. Okay, so they're just gonna keep coming back. But it looks like... One and done with the blast. That person's back. So this isn't on the map, this section. Makes me want to explore it. Uh. I can't make that jump. I can't, I don't think I, yeah, I can't go here. This looks like a shortcut anyways. see that coming. Oh! They show up on the walls too. Interesting. Okay. heal up. same enemies too. There's still some other one. Yet to die, I don't plan on dying. <laughs> I think 
get streaked. 